Well, 2012 mining season is just about to begin. Got my new, uh, new and improved recirculating high banker here. Got this new screen. Got a nice big pull filter in the tub. It'll work pretty good at home. We're going to find out how good it runs material up here. I call it the echo banker. If it works out, Guy be able to take this system out to the desert, up here in the dry creek, or maybe even go set it up next to all the environmentalists out there on the river. High bank right next to the river without worrying about doing any contamination whatsoever. So we're going to give it a run here, and uh, we're going to see how it goes. Hopefully it goes good. Well, the screen worked pretty good. Didn't let anything go through. Only thing gets in the tub is minus 60. Problem is, is the filter over there. I, I was after one bucket. So it started to choke off the pump. It was still pumping, but it was straining. So I don't think that type of a filter is going to work. But had to start somewhere. At least we know that a inch and a half port, 60 square foot pool filter will get you about one bucket, which is no good. Okay, well it looks like the sluice box is running pretty good. All the riffles are nice, evenly packed up there with material. That's after five buckets worth. A little punch plate and whatnot seems to be doing a good job. The screen is working. It's going to need to have some modifications done to it. Water's dropping through it, but off the back, underneath the sluice box, if it builds up, it's kind of rolling off the back, and I don't want to lose any water. So I've got to make it deeper for one. Um, maybe a little bit longer. Water's dropping through it. When you get off to the very end, sometimes a little bit we're losing a little bit of water. And our little filter packs, these things, I wasn't quite sure how they were going to work. There's two of them in there. One of them dropped out, which means it's collecting dirt, 
That's good. I just need to put like uh, some expanded metal underneath it to keep them in there. You can take them out and clean them. But so far, those filters and this screen is working good. That filter got plugged up in one bucket. So that's out. I think the only way you could do it is if you had it underneath some high pressure and you could filter out say maybe 10 20 micron bags but you'd have to have the thing underneath quite a bit of pressure to force the water through that so that's it's not the end of the road but we're gonna have to do a little bit more thinking I was hoping to get a little bit more clean water that water is the same as if when we were running buckets um, I haven't checked the bottom of the tank I doubt if there's much in there compared to when we use the bucket but we're losing water so I've lost in five gallons we lost an inch and a half of water in the tub and that is unacceptable but the important thing now is did we get any gold probably not this is just the first you know top layer in this creek depending on how much got pushed through here with the uh, with the winter we'll see so we'll do a clean up here in a minute and uh, see what we got. 